today is uh, regarding the latest um, announcement that now the management and board of directors of MDB are saying that they are the one who has been making all the decisions and responsible for decisions, especially on the particular uh, Petro Saudi US 1.9 billion loan. Now the question we are asking here is that why did it take them so long to come up with this declaration? Yeah? This 1.9 billion US dollar loan to Petro Saudi was one of the earliest uh, exposure made <coughs> to the public. But it took them many, many months to come up with this so-called uh, declaration that they were the one responsible. Now we find it very difficult to accept this, that um, they are saying that since they are the one uh, responsible, as if to say, the Prime Minister, Datuk Sri Najib, are not to be blamed for whatever has been uh, happening with the funds uh, from YMDB. What we like to ask is that the board of directors are supposed to be, and they are senior yeah? uh, people in the corporate world with particular knowledge and experience. Now, the three things we like to ask is that uh, with their experience, firstly, TIA only survived for nine months. Yeah? Nine months. TIA is the Trungganu Investment uh, Authority, which was uh, preceding uh, YMDB. Why did it only last nine months? Showing that it lacked planning, proper management, and it was closed or shut down after a very short period. But not before uh, securing facility for five billion ringgit. And this is considering a company does not have any project or any uh, assets to its name. So this is very peculiar yeah, for a company, TIA, to exist just for nine months with such experienced people at the helm. Uh, this shows that there must have been some interference at a higher level. And the other question we'd like to ask is that to secure a five billion facility with no collateral, no project, you must need a very strong backing and some very strong experience uh, hands, especially in the Ministry of Finance. And guess who is in the Minister? Is the Minister of Finance? It is the Prime Minister himself, Datuk Sri Najib. So everywhere you look, anyhow you look, the box stop at Datuk Sri Najib. So there's no point yeah, in this uh, Board of Directors resigning or saying that they are responsible because they already made an earlier announcement that they are going to resign anyway. So they are going to be the fall guy, they are going to be the scapegoat, and it is um, purely academic because of the earlier announcement that they are going to resign. Now the question is, why does not the Prime Minister take the blame himself? Yeah?